Golf is a game steeped in tradition, but one of the game's customs is in danger of going extinct. This week at Kingsmill, they're doing their best to keep it alive. It's a lost art. It's, it's really the only place on the golf course that you can see all the players and their scores at one spot. Paul Pope is one of the last of a dying breed. He's a scoreboard calligrapher. Before the days of digital scoreboards and smartphones, setups like his were often the only way for fans to see the leaderboard. Each person that does a scoreboard has a different style. And again, we're all artists per se. It takes some time, it ta it'll take me you know, four or five hours to do a full 144 player scoreboard. When you come back here on Sunday afternoon, there'll be multitudes of pictures up here of different things that happen. You know, I'll put up records or you know, draw little figures. If somebody has a hole in one, I'll put up a little nice little sign for them. Paul is based out of Columbus, Ohio and has a full-time job in the golf industry. When he started as a calligrapher back in the mid-90s, he was working 25 to 30 tournaments a year, 10 of them on the LPGA. This season, Kingsmill is his only LPGA job. He might work one or two other tournaments on other tours this season. To me, it's breaking away from tradition. Golf is a traditional game, and it's just hard for me to, to grasp that this type of stuff is going away. This tournament has been great about keeping the tradition alive. The tournament directors and, and the staff has been encouraging you know, to, to bring this back each year, which is great for, for the fans here of the tournament. In Williamsburg, Matt Estrich, NBC 12 Sports.